Welcome to the Wind Down with Miss Amarachi. Today we're winding down with the McBride sisters and their Black Girl Magic Red Blend. We love a good Black Girl Magic. Now I'll get into the tasting later on, but before then, let me give y'all the tea because the McBride sisters really did their thing with this one. Created in 2019 in California, this bottle of wine contains 13.5% alcohol by volume. Lean. This wine is described as a complex, well-crafted, and inviting wine that shows tobacco and vanilla notes alongside generous plum, raspberry, and blackberry. The ripe and juicy mouth offers the chocolate cherry flavors typical of Merlot blend with the peppery spice of Cabernet to round out the full body. The finish is bold, gripping, and invites another sip. So let's sip. Cheers. Okay. So, for those of you who don't know, I'm a very, very sweet girl. I love my Moscatos. I love my Rosés. This is not for the sweet girls. Let me tell you why. It's very bitter. It's very very, very bitter. I mean, it smells very, very rich. It smells bold. I mean, it smells and tastes like a Merlot mixed with a Cabernet, which is what the description said. But that 13.5% alcohol is definitely going to get you right, okay? All in all, I would probably rate this out of 10. For me, a 5. This is not something that I would, well, actually, maybe a 6.5. 6.5. This is not something that I would grab on an everyday basis if I was, you know, wanting to just take the edge off at night and, and want something to just kind of round out my night. Again, I'm more of a sweet girl, so this is not something I would just grab for or reach for at first, but it is very smooth. It's very rich. It would probably go very well with dark meat. I don't eat dark meat, but you know, for those of you who do, this would probably pair very well with a steak. So definitely try this when you um, when you have the chance. So a little bit about the price point. So I was fortunate to pick this up at Target. Um, for those of you who have alcohol in your grocery stores or your, you know, other stores, shout out to California, you can definitely pick this wine up at a Target, at a Walmart, um, or at any liquor store, really. Um, at the Target, it did retail for $24.99. After doing some research, it can fall anywhere between $19.99 and $25, uh, just depending on where you get it from. And if you're like me with a very, very, very bad sweet tooth, um, they have other wines that you can also try. So in addition to the Red Blend, they have a Riesling, they have a Rosé, uh, I believe they have a White, don't quote me on it, but I do know that they have at least two other, um, you know, types of wines. So definitely check them out, they're black owned, they're woman owned, I love it. Again, I'll rate this a 6.5 out of 10, it was a very enjoyable experience, it wasn't terrible, just wasn't my taste, per se. Um, but as always, thank you all for joining me for another episode of The Wine Down. If there's any wines that you all would like for me to try, make sure y'all comment them down below or DM me on any social media and I'll definitely check them out. Tune in next week. You'll see what I'm going to be winding down with.